let's take few more steps ahead. Mm-hmm. Um, let's come to 2016 December where we are sitting right now. Mm-hmm. Um, we all realize the fact that you have created value, uh, not only for yourself but for others also. Mm-hmm. They look up to you. They they look up to you for your advice, for your guidance, for your mentorship, right? Uh, but obviously, when you both started, uh, it was very naive. It was you didn't right. we couldn't see it clearly, right? The dots, as uh, Steve Jobs had said, mm-hmm. the dots in our life gets connected ahead. You just can't join the dots right now. Mm-hmm. It falls in place. Mm-hmm. So when did you realize you you started from a very different part of the world than Shomya? And obviously the dots are joined. Mm-hmm. But during the process, there was some day, some moment when you realize, hold it. Mm-hmm. What is my passion and what I am doing has created a little value for myself and maybe for others. Mm-hmm. And this can be the next five years of my life. And that five can extend to another 10 and 15. Mm-hmm. So when did you realize in your life that, okay, I think I can have, I, you know, I can call myself Arun Stock you know, for so just to clarify, like I mean, this stock guru tag is pretty controversial. It's actually, I mean, when I was thinking of you know initiating a blog, I was actually looking for a catchy name. In the year of 2006, I mean, I watched a movie called Partner, you know, and Salman Khan actually played the protagonist. So he had that love guru tag, you know. And I thought like, okay, this love guru tag, you know, I mean, seems pretty catchy. So if you can actually put my name in front and this, you know, guru tag behind, it, it makes a pretty controversial catchy tag. Either people are going to say, okay, so we have got a guru now, you know, maybe they can play the sarcastic role. But again, this thing should be, you know, embedded in their mind. Right. So that actually paved the way for my stock guru thing. I am not a stock guru in any means. We all are like students of the game. Uh-huh. I have been putting like 10 to 12 man hours a day over the last 12, 13 years or so. I am learning. Nobody can be a master in stock markets. It's an unending sea. You know, you evolve always. I've been evolving. I probably have got much more blunders than my success stories. But it's from the failures that you learn. I have learned nothing from my successes. Though fortunate to make some money, probably would be mid fortunate to make much more. You know, right. when I grow older. But since in markets, you know, we are still young. I believe, like I'm 28, he's 26, and we lack an expiry, right? It's not a cricket field or a football field that after 35. You know, you would obviously you would be forced to take a retirement, right? In our part of the world or in our business or in our markets, there is no expiry. In fact, Mr. Buffett, who obviously happens to be the third richest man in the world, the greatest investor of all times, is 85 nearly and people would be paying him, you know, 15 crores just to have a lunch with him. So that thing gives us the kick, right? Exactly, exactly. But then, going back to my question a bit, right? When did you realize that nee, I have to, I am on the right path? You know, when, when we are young, we are kind of lost. Uh, we listen to others, elders, do this, do, do, do that. Then we soon realize this is not me. And that's happened most of the time. And probably we are the very few lucky ones who are actually walking our passion. Mm-hmm. So what, what, what I'm trying to get is when did you realize, was nee, I am on the right path and this path is, you know, can take me a long way or I can add value to others. Mm-hmm. So when did you realize this? Probably the time when I started writing blogs because at that point of a time India was amidst of a crazy bull market. You know everything was moving to the northwards trajectory big big time. I mean so the likes of Unix Inutech which was quoting at 300 bucks in the year of 2013 went to 42,000 in the year of 2007. So a huge amount of wealth creation right. And I started thinking guys like this is genuine wealth creation right. In, in our I mean, our parents, they are habituated in putting their savings to FDs and FDs would always give an interest rate of 8%, right? Inflation would be a bit higher probably. I'm talking about core inflation. So that cancels each other, right? So your actual savings is none. So if you are to generate real good money, you are only left with stocks. And fortunately or unfortunately in India itself, stocks ain't considered as an asset till date. So I thought like if by means of stock ownership, if I can make some money, and actually can help others in knowing the nitty gritties of stock market. You know, it would be, I mean, it would be beneficial to everyone, right? Not only I would be learning, but I would be sharing my stuff through my readers, through the blog itself. And they incidentally would also be in a position to learn and learn simultaneously. Okay. Okay. Uh, 
Yeah, in terms of say, uh, coming back to the first question, workshops and all, uh, it was a very random thing that we started doing. So we were actually, uh, you know, just sitting in a place and having chilling and suddenly what happened, we thought that, okay, listen, we have attended, me and our other partner, uh, not Arun, so we attended a lot of sessions. So wherever we could think that we'll get knowledge, when we started, we went there and we thought that it was very theoretical. And we did not get what we wanted to hear, what we wanted to know. Mm -hmm. uh, so we thought that, you know, let us create something that we want. Mm -hmm. right. Now that we are in a position that we have actually put in so much effort to learn those things, mm -hmm. probably let us design something. And uh, in our first workshop, honestly, we did not even have a presentation or something. It was Everything was from heart. There right. were barely 20 people there and the people liked it a lot. And uh, from there, uh, you know, we just started it and we thought there was, okay, no, stopping. There was no stopping actually.